Welcome back, everyone. In studio now, we have Andy Ellison with PCs for People. And Andy, I first thought to call you guys. I've heard of your organization, of course, before, but I know of a student recently who was trying to do all of his college work on his phone, and he was getting it done. He was determined. But then he went to PCs for People to try oh, to get some help. That's a great and story. He showed yeah. up in class, and he was so proud of the computer that yeah, he had. It's, it's hard to do many of the applications that we have today on a phone. Mm -hmm. um, whether you're applying for something, checking your medical right. records, communicating, trying to ap apply for a job, it's just you need a, a computer. You do. Yes. Yeah. So let's talk about what your mission is. Okay, so well, through reuse and recycling, we work with businesses and organizations, corporations, school districts, the private, public entities, and we recycle their equipment and we, I think we've recycled 13 million pounds so far wow. nationally. And what we can then reuse, we make available to low income folks for their use, just like this student mm -hmm. that um, ev everyone needs a computer um, to do, you know, with COVID when they sent all the kids home right. from school, I think there was, they estimated maybe 25 million students did not have a device when they, when they mm -hmm. were sent home. So. The digital divide is is what our mission is, providing internet services to low-income folks and nonprofits, and helping with digital skills. Yeah. So there are two ways we can approach this here. First, yeah. let's talk about if someone is in need of this, what do they do? Um, well, they can go to our website, pcsforpeople.org, or they can call the phone number that I gave you earlier. and. Um, they basically would come into one of our retail locations or go on our online store and purchase a, 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 a computer from us and the average cost is probably about $85 mm. for a laptop or a desktop. Awesome. And are you finding that your um, equipment is going toward more younger like kids or is it more toward adults or is it kind of it, a mixture? It's a good mixture because in this day and age Everybody, you know, you, you need a computer to do so many things. And so um, we're finding that, you know, young children on up to senior citizens are needing this technology. Mm -hmm. You know, a lot of communities are, have like a food bank or a food shelf. Right. And I, how I describe PCs for people to folks is that we're a, we're a food shelf for technology. Mm -hmm. People do not have the equipment and they need it. So that, that's what we try to provide. Yeah, so the other part of that is how can folks help you out? How can they give you their recyclable technology. Certainly. We, we have become recyclers at a very large scale and uh, we have a thousand partners nationally that we recycle for businesses, corporations, and so we've also become certified in data destruction. Actually, I saw kind of a cool video on our website this morning, I hadn't seen it before, of a machine crushing hard drives to, mm. to secure the data of, mm -hmm. of businesses. And so all of our services are free that we provide for um, businesses and individuals when they when they recycle their tech with us. Uh, a lot of companies will charge, but we we come up and, and pick it up for nothing. And then you know, with our mission, the good news is these these businesses can reinvest in their communities by helping us get mm -hmm. equipment into the hands of those who need it the most. Yeah, and, and this is some of the equipment that you guys offer. So right. obviously we've seen a laptop before, yes. but let's talk about um, a couple other things you brought. Sure, well we all, we've all seen a laptop and we all have seen the computer tower that sits mm -hmm. under the desk for years. This is another type of a computer. It does the thing that uh, the, the tower desktop would do or mm -hmm. the laptop. And this is a hotspot. I would just, that is something that we, that's very popular with mm -hmm. folks that we work with. Uh, for a very low cost, people can have internet coverage, and they, that's nice because you can just put it in your backpack and go, and everywhere you go, yeah. you have internet, whether you're using your laptop, uh, your phone, or mm -hmm. whatever. Oh, great information, Andy. We'll get the phone number put on the website for everyone. Thanks. All right, thanks for coming in. All right, more on Cato Living. When